most club players are only interested in winning and losing and playing a game of tennis. They're not truthfully interested in using my principles of teaching to the nth degree. In other words, I always talk about technical, physical and mental skills. Now those three things combined produce a good stroke. But cup players break through this, all they're interested in doing is getting the ball over the net and into court. And when they serve, this is if they've never been taught. They whack the first one as hard as they can, and then they poop a doop the second one. And they need that poopy doop serve because the first one only goes in one in twenty. So you've got to convince them that there is a technical way of serving which helps them get the ball in the court. And I use the principle of there are three ways to serve. Racket and ball up together in front is the easiest principle. The second principle is to take the racket down and out at the side. And the third is down, out the back and hit the ball. So I usually demonstrate that to them and what happens then is that I ask them now which one of the three would you like? All of them and it never fails say the third principle ball and racket starting together down right out the back racket up behind the head ball in the air hit the ball follow through on the left hand side of the body. Now this serve is a skillfully produced technical serve and so what they actually do is they'd like to have the serve but they're not prepared to work at it or previously they hadn't and I don't think that's a very good idea. Most of them take it down in front, take it up in front of them, hit the ball. So I'm an advocate that the one in between, the second of the service actions, taking it down and then out at the side, behind the head and throwing at the ball is the ideal serve to introduce and keep if necessary as the a standard club service. Some of the best players in the world use this technique some even use the first one. Now if you get this down and out the side one going properly they really can throw the racket head at the ball and of course it requires uh, a different grip than down and up in front. So you have a lot of work to work with and it doesn't hurt them a lot because it's close to what they normally do. So I'm an advocate that that type of serve is possibly the best. But if you're looking at a beautifully produced one, then taking it down and out the back and uh, what have you is a beautiful thing to watch.